all I have to do is go sit in a tiny patch of rainforest and I see more species in a half an hour than I see in a year uh, in Washington State, for example. So the biodiversity and the, the thrum of life that exists in this rainforest has helped me fall in love with the tropics and with tropical ecology. My name is Zoe Greenberg and I am a naturalist with Lindblad Expeditions. So we are on the Costa Rica and Panama Canal itinerary and right now we are on the Osa Peninsula which is a very remote part of Costa Rica that is well known for its biodiversity and its beautiful national park Corcovado which is a huge part of the peninsula. It's one of the most amazing places that we visit. So it's very protected. It's where the rainforest meets the sea, and it hosts one of the largest populations of scarlet macaws in the world, and the largest in Central America. And we can also see humpback whales here, and it's one of the only places in the world where the northern and the southern populations meet. So it's a genetic mixing spot for the, that species, which is a very big deal. Additionally, we can see over 400 species of birds. We can see a diverse array of mammals here. One of the most fun aspects of this peninsula is that we have to work for it. So there are so many animals in, a, in this forest and they're competing for space. The plants are competing for light. There's so much going on that we really have to hone into our observation skills, but we learn a lot in that process. So the Osa Peninsula was not always a place that people went to see the ecology and the biodiversity. There was a lot of mining for gold here in the 1930s and fruit was a big uh, part of the economy. Eventually in the 1970s uh, attention started to turn towards the ecological value of this place and in 1975 Corcovado National Park became a reality. The Osa Peninsula uh, holds a very special place in my heart because it was the first place I ever traveled by myself and that was the start of a, a long relationship with this peninsula. I have just time and time again been shocked at how how alive my senses feel when I'm here. No matter what your interests are or which sense you like to rely on, there is something here for you to fall in love with.